depends on how you look at what's the best rivalry. You look at Baltimore, Pittsburgh. I mean, every time those teams play, it is a bloodbath. I still think uh, Baltimore and, uh, and Pittsburgh, uh, it's, it's there. It's always going to be there. But, but quickly coming on fast is San Francisco, Seattle. Uh, those games are epic. Seattle, San Francisco, two big bad guys. I mean, it's like the two bullies fighting, and you know, you hope they both lose if you're anybody else. That's a train wreck you gotta watch. There's no love lost between them. Think about it, when those two play each other, uh, there's always some, uh, some penalties for a little extra business. There's always some comments going on during the game. Playoff game last year, I hadn't seen a game that hard hitting in a very long time. That's a brutal rivalry right there. They, they get after each other and they're two of the best, if not the best teams in football, at least last couple years they have been. There's so many great rivalries. You can never discount the Jets-Patriots rivalry, no matter how lopsided it may be from time to time. You know, I was a part of the, the Cowboys-Redskins rivalry. That's one of the greatest ones all time that I know firsthand about and what it means. I grew up in Chicago, and there was nothing more fierce than the Bears taking on the Packers. When I was a kid, there were some years where the Bears were really awful. And here come the Packers to town, and it didn't matter if the Bears were 0-7 or 0-8. If they could knock off Green Bay on that one day, it made the season.